a beautiful rainy day. Uh, I just made the mistake of uh, driving my truck all the way down the range and I almost got stuck. I slid off, wiped out my 150 yard spinner. Uh, Son of a gun. Whose idea was it to try to shoot in the heavy rain? Oh boy. All right, let's get back to that tent, get set up. So I'll have to get another one of those. But um, I, uh, in the last video, I made a video uh, about uh, bow tail slugs versus regular slugs. Uh, and in the comments, someone was asking, um, how would the, uh, you know, the slug shoot in a nice steady rain? So uh, today's raining, so I figured it'd be the day to try this out. Um, I'm here today with my Vulcan, the 700 millimeter. Um, this is a 25 cal. Um, I'm shooting this at 100, 970 feet per second. Um, I sighted in this yesterday with bow tail slugs. These are the ABS bow tails, the same slugs I used in the last video with the uh, Pantera. Um, this is going about 20 feet per second faster. Um, I put this regulator up to 175 bar, and I have the custom uh, spring from uh, the hammer spring from Talon Tunes. So uh, this is uh, shooting pretty fast now, a little bit faster than Pantera. So uh, yesterday I got this all sighted in. Um, I got it sighted in at 50 yards. I'm going to start at 50 yards. I'm going to run right out and see um, if we're still on in this rain, whether the rain is going to really affect the accuracy or, or how much these bullets drop. But uh, I'm sure it probably won't do much at 50 or, six, uh, or 100 yards, but we'll see what it does at some longer yards here. So let me uh, load up. So the bow tail slugs, uh, I said in some of my other videos, they do not cycle in this mag. So I have to put one in at a time. So we'll do one at a time. We'll start off at 50 yards. We'll get the camera going. And we'll just move right out there and see what it looks like at all these different ranges. I'm sure it won't have much effect at the 50 yards, but we'll take a quick look at it. All right, we're recording at 50. I'll just take the uh, I'll take the big spinner there at 50 yards, and then we'll move right into 100. Oh, I better put it back to zero. I had it on for 500 from yesterday. All right, back to zero, here we go. Hopefully you guys can hear me right with this rain, it's probably pretty loud in the tent. All right, first shot at 50 yards. All right, no problem at 50, let's move right to 100. Okay, we're recording at 100, let's see what we can do. 100 is gonna be, 0.2, 2 mils up. Right there, let's see what we got. All right, let's see, at 100 yards, I'm focused in there. Let's try the middle spinner. All right, here we go. Did not see that. Did I do this right? Let's try it again. So maybe we caught a raindrop. It was right on 100 yesterday. Let's see. Try it again. All right, there it is, right in the center. All right, so I guess if you do catch a raindrop, you can throw it, because I didn't even see where that went on that one there. So uh, let's move out to 150. I'll try that saw blade at 150. All right, here we go. 150 will be. Come on. 150. 4.9. Alright, see what 150 looks like. We're still recording. And when I get to 300 yards, I'll, I'll try to make a bunch of shots and see if, uh, if there's any consistency in the rain here. Alright, so we'll try this blade at 150. Oh, knocked it right down. Alright, we'll go right to 200. Two hundred is eight point one. Six, seven, eight point one. All right, let's see. I got a balloon at two hundred. Let me move the camera again. Two 
All right, I got the camera set up on 200 and 250. So we'll try 200 first. All right, 200. 8.1, let's see what that looks like. You can see that rains, it's raining pretty good. All right, gonna aim right at it. Okay, balloon's down at 200. Let's go to 250. Eleven point six. Okay, we got eleven point six at two fifty. Just tell me put in uh, point two for spring drift, but I have the wind going the other way a little bit, so I'm gonna just kind of leave it there. See what it looks like. We'll make some corrections once we got to three hundred. All right, well, we got two fifty. We're recording. There it is. All right, 250's gone. We'll go out to 300. All right, so uh, my balloon blew away at 300 yards, so I'm going to uh, I'm going to zoom this in a little bit so we can see the can. All right, see how that looks. All right, we got a can at 300 yards. The can is at 15.4 over the target. We'll see if that's going to make a difference. We'll go all the way back to zero. Six, 12, 13, 14, 15, 0.4. All right, and then we'll do uh, two for spin drift. All right, let's see what we got. We'll try 300 yards at a soda can. If I can see the impacts, then uh, we'll try to make the correction. I was hoping to take the balloon and then shoot out the can and eggs after, but we'll see what happens here. All right, we'll see how close we are at 300 yards. First shot at a soda can and I ain't record. All right, here we are. All right, let's see how close we are. It was pretty darn close yesterday. We'll see if we're off today in the rain. Oh, just, just below it. So maybe I'm just a little bit low. I'm gonna aim right at it again. I'm surprised the, uh, the raindrops aren't making these go all over the place. Let's try one more time here. Come on. Oh, same spot. I'm going to hold it just a little bit over, maybe a tenth of a mil. I'll go one click up, see if that will make a difference. All right, here we go. There it is. Okay, so um, I was a little bit off, but um, only a tenth. So I was a tenth low at, a, at a 300 yards. Um, even the, maybe the speed, maybe it cooled down a little bit, but let's see if we can get some eggs while we're right there. And then I do have a balloon at 500 yards. So we'll make a pop shot at 500 yards at a balloon also. Actually, I have two yellow balloons out there. All right, so uh, still recording. I will take the egg to the right. Come on. Oh, I rolled it down the hill. I do that all the time. Jesus. All right, try another one. I did that three times with my Pantera the other day. All right, come on. Shooting better than I thought in the rain. Oh, just above it. It'd be real nice if these uh, bolt tails cycled in the, uh, in the Vulcan here. But it's shooting pretty good in the rain here. Let's see what we got. Come on. Oh, I moved it down the hill just a little bit. Right again. I got plenty of slugs and plenty of air, so. Right, come on. Come on. I don't know if you hit a little raindrop and it moves it or not. All right, here we go. Try again. <laughs> Just barely to the right of it. I'm gonna use up this whole bag of slugs. All right. Come on.
<laughs> just a hair to the left. Maybe I should just wait for better days, but come on, I think it's a bit to get it. It's going to be a matter of how many shots. Ah, oh, I moved it again. So close. right there. Moved it again. All right, let's go. I'm gonna go to the other egg because that egg's kind of buried. Give me a little bigger target. All right, so we'll go to the next egg over. There we go. Come on. Oh! Roll it down the hill again. I'm gonna have to get something to hold those suckers up there. Come on. Let's get an egg. Let's go. Just to the left of it. I'm actually surprised it's shooting as well as it is in the rain. It's a pretty pretty hard steady rain. Oh, I moved it. Jeez. I'm getting a little frustrated now. <laughs> Alright, come on. Oh, that was a little high. Come on! Jeez! So close. Sometimes it's just luck. Sometimes you get them. Sometimes you don't. All right, here we go. Oh, now I'm moving pretty good. That was pretty high. <laughs> took a lot of shots but I got it <laughs> all right well uh, I wasn't even counting that was a lot of shots but um they were they were pretty close so uh, that's not too bad in the rain I don't think all right so we got a couple eggs there and we got the can at uh at 3 yards now let's go for 500 yards uh, we'll take a couple top shots at two yellow balloons all right 500 yards is 33.4 all the way back six 12 18, 24, 30, 31, 32, 33, point four. All right, and we'll go five to the left for spin drift. Don't look if there's any wind out there. Okay, let's see what we got. Are we recording? We record on the big camera. Let me zoom that in. All right, let's take that balloon on the right. All right, here we go. Got plenty of air still in there. Doing the 50 grain bow tails one at a time. All right, let's, hopefully we can see the impact and we'll make a correction. Oh, it's right there. Good shot. All right. All right, let's try another one. Oh man, so that other balloon just popped before I can uh, record it or it just popped by the wind blowing it but uh, uh we got a soda can so might as well try a soda can let's see what it looks like all right let's try that coke can oh i got it <laughs> all right it's still pouring down the hill okay pretty good um that other Bloom popped, unfortunately, but um, that's pretty darn good that the uh, you can be able to get a soda can in this kind of rain. I wasn't expecting that. Let me um, I got nothing else out there. Let's take a look. Now that can is gone, and the other balloon's gone. I don't know what happened to the balloon at 300 yards. That blew away somewhere. But uh, well, I guess that's gonna do it. Um, I'm very surprised. I didn't think that I was gonna be making these shots 
in this steady rain, but um, I guess the rain doesn't affect as much as we thought. The um, It was just just off a couple times there. I missed that at 100, it could have just been me. I don't know if you catch a raindrop if they go flying or not, but uh, that's pretty good. So anyways, uh, that's gonna do it for today. Um, I guess these uh, bull tail slugs do pretty well in the rain also, so what are you gonna do? And uh, this is shooting a little bit faster than my Pantera. I'm not sure how that would have done in the rain today, but uh, you see the front of my barrel is all wet. But uh, that's gonna do it for today, so until next time, bye bye.